Hey guys, Matt with Atlantic Firearms out here, squinting a little bit in the sun, taking a look at some cool new stuff that we tried out. This is PVD finish here, guys, and this is the TIN uh, coating here, and that's the titanium nitride coating that you see on some tools nowadays. You'll see this stuff on drill bits. You see this on different machine tools for mills and other things of that nature. It increases tool life by hardening the surface of the metal and what we did was we had some interest in this so we went out and tried several different pieces and having them done by several different companies to see how they all came out because honestly these parts looked really cool to us when we started and um, we wanted to see what it could what we could bring to an AK with it I mean we went as far as to have this one complete AK done some of the stuff just didn't come out the way that we really thought it was going to and that is, you know, what's brought us here today. We wanted to show you guys what we have done. And then, you know, we are going to sell the stuff that we did have done. We had a small sampling of it. But we're not going further with this at this time until we hear a little bit of input from you guys on it. Because um, I think that that'd be very valuable. Some of the parts feel like they could be a little bit richer in color. However, at the same time, they are coated and they look good. And it's a hard working surface. So I'd, I'd like you to consider that. We did all kinds of different things. We did magazines, just the whole magazine body, the floor plate, then the internals are the you know standard internals. There's no oil or anything on this right now, guys. So these are dry. You could hit this with a little bit of oil. It would even the tone up greatly. Did ALG triggers, a couple ALG triggers. They look awesome in gold, right? These came out really good. And a lot of what we learned in this process is so much of this is dependent upon the base metal and the base metal finishes as well. So we did the ALG trigger. We did some uh, RAK1 triggers from Century. Really the same thing came out about the same as the ALG trigger did. Did some selector levers, accent pieces that we thought guys might wanna, you know, spice up the AK that they currently have that's, you know, black. Hey, I'll throw a couple of these, these different parts on there, really dress it up nicely, and increased, uh, you know, finish life on these we did sling swivels we did some butt plates metal butt plates for wood stocks these are brand new wbp akm bolts these haven't been obviously have not been fitted or head spaced or anything like that but cool part to add to your gun you'd see that bolt in there we did the bolt carrier this goes back to what i was talking about as far as the surface metal or the metal that's underneath and how that takes takes the treatment because this this treatment's applied in a vacuum it's not a paint or anything like that uh, basically the the part is is captured in a vacuum and then the vapor inside the vacuum adheres to the metal so really cool process overall but you can definitely see the difference in in tone here we did other hardware pieces stock set screws axis pins some other little screws for your stocks and such. Did this rear sight base with just the rear leaf. It's kind of cool looking too. Definitive arms, fighter brakes. Love the fighter brake, it's a great brake. Be cool to be gold. If you don't like fighter brake, hey, we got slant, slant brake too. So, little, little bit of diversity here as far as parts, but mostly all accent parts. Uh, we would love to hear your feedback about this and what you guys think about them because uh, you know we, we have our own feelings about them too. So. We want to we want to get all this information together and go ahead and make a good decision about that but anyways for the time being all this stuff's up for sale and if you guys have questions about it reach out to us sales at atlanticfirearms.com you can always catch us on youtube instagram facebook as well and we certainly would appreciate your comments regarding this particular subject um, so we can go ahead and make a decision whether to continue to do this or you know maybe this is something that this is where it ends right here and you get a limited edition product so guys, let us know what you think. And thanks again for tuning in. Always, we appreciate your support and your business. Thank you.